What is going on everybody and welcome back to the channel. I'll be giving away this knife at 1500 subscribers. All you need to do to enter this giveaway is be a subscriber, leave a like on this video, and comment down below. Make sure your Steam ID or trade link is in the description of your YouTube channel. Now let's get into the video. In today's video we're going to be talking about how you can trade your way up to a knife for absolutely free in CS2. This will work for anyone that plays CS2 and will allow you to get a knife that you like. Maybe you're a fan of the Shadow Dagger Tiger Tooth, maybe the M9 Bayonet Doppler, or possibly the Karambit Marble Fade. So the first thing you're going to want to do is simply play CSGO. With the new CS2 system you'll get two drops every week on your first level up. This can be found here in the store section under the weekly care package. Every time you level up for the first time at the start of a week, you'll be able to choose two out of the four items that are available in your rewards for that week. And that is how it all gets started. You're always going to want to choose the case and a skin. Even if the skin is not most likely valuable, probably around two to three cents, you're gonna wanna choose it instead of the graffiti. You'll most likely get one of the active case drops, this being the revolution case, the recoil case, the dreams and nightmare case, the snake bite case, or the fracture case. Obviously, depending on which one you get, it'll limit how much you can do in your first week. If you do get the dreams and nightmare case, that is definitely the best one to get, and the least one that you want is the snake bite case. However, if you do this for a couple weeks, you'll be able to move on to the second step. After playing for a couple of weeks, you now have a starting point of a few dollars that you can begin doing some low tier trade ups for a profit. So the first thing you're going to want to do is head over to tradeupspy.com and head over to the trade ups tab at the top. This here will show you three different trade ups that are free that you can inspect or copy and they will refresh every week. As you can see up here, there'll be three days and 26 minutes until these refresh. You're gonna to wanna to look for ones around a one to $3 cost per trade up, depending on how much you have from selling your skins and how many weeks you were playing CS and sold your cases. So we're gonna say that we are at the lowest right here. So you'll see risk grade in the green, which means it's not very risky and availability how available these skins are to get. So you're gonna to wanna to press inspect on this one here. You're gonna see the average trade up cost of $1.56. The profitability being 111%, that is gonna be if you get the highest priced skin, which will be this one right here at $2.44, almost a dollar above the cost for this trade up. And the odds to profit on this are 93%. That means every 100 times you do this trade up, you will profit 93 out of those 100 times on average. Obviously, the 1.78 and the 1.79 are your lowest percent profits. However, you are still profiting, but once you do that steam fee, you may not make as much of a profit. So what you're going to need in this trade here, you're going to need nine or sorry, 10 skins, four being the very camo tech nines under a 0 0.09 float, minimal wear under a 0 0.09. Next, you're gonna need five of these 5.7 orange peels. You're gonna need them in a field tested under a 0.2. And lastly, you're gonna need one Glock 18 death rattle in a minimal wear under a 0 0.09. Now these prices here are the prices you're gonna to wanna to pay. You're not gonna to wanna to pay over 12 cents for this one, over 19 cents for this one, and over 20 cents for this one. Due to this being free, you're going to want to make sure to check at the start of each week and buy these skins as fast as possible before the prices do increase on them a bit. And once you do that, you'll be able to do your trade-ups and get a profit from them. Before we get any further into this video, I will be making a series on Nothing to a Knife that you guys can follow along with. Make sure to turn on my post notifications so you don't miss out on those videos which will be coming very soon. So the next thing you're going to want to do after doing multiple trade-ups for a profit is sell the skins that you have. Obviously each week you're going to want to continue to sell your items and do more and more expensive trade-ups and work your way up to around a $30 to $40 in your CS account after you sell your skins. You're going to want to sell your skins on any third-party sites such as Skinport or any other trusted sites that are out there. 
From that, you're going to want to invest in some low tier to mid tier skins with your $30. The easiest way to make a profit doing this on websites like this is go over to the see all section, press newest, and press live. This will now auto refresh any item that is posted. This will be your easiest way to purchase a skin at a discount instead of having to search the skin you want and then try and find one at a discount. You're gonna to wanna to find one around a 20 to 30% discount. I would say aim for 25 to 30%. However, you still are profitable if you do a 20% discount. So you're gonna sit here and wait for them to refresh. When you do find an item that is at a good discount, you're gonna obviously just wanna press add to cart so you can see here, we got a scout for 27% uh, discount. It's moving away here now. 27, you're gonna to wanna to press add to cart. It's in my cart and then you would go up and purchase it. Um, with that, you're then gonna be able to go and relist it, maybe put it at a 10% discount. And after you pay that 12% fee, you'll still be in a profit. Now, the easiest way to sell these skins at maybe a 10% discount is wait for them to be tradable. So to do this, you want to just leave it in your Skinport account or whatever website you are using instead of moving it over to your Steam inventory. If you move it to your Steam inventory and then move it back, it'll be on a seven day trade hold, which you will not want. You want to keep it in here until the trade hold is up and then resell it instantly and then come back over to this tab and repurchase items like this that are at a 26% discount and continue to flip them like that. While you are doing these steps, you'll want to still be playing CS and still earning your free case each week. Every case is free money, 40 cents to $2 depending on the case you get, which just helps add and build up on how fast you can get to that knife. After you do that, you're going to then want to flip into some higher tier skins. Continue to work your way up until you have enough money to afford a knife. Currently knives, you can probably get them around the $100 um, dollar mark. I'm going to go to newest here, or not even newest, but in here you can still see even knives at discount. Um, or you can go here and you can go to cheapest first. Cheapest being $100 and four dollars Canadian that's around seventy five dollars US so you can get to a knife very quickly by following these simple steps there's also one other method to get a knife for free in CSGO and this is simply just watching people on YouTube and entering their giveaways there are tons of CS channels out there that do weekly giveaways monthly giveaways or subscriber goal giveaways they're completely free to enter. There's no risk involved. It takes none of your time other than following the steps they say to enter the giveaway. Hopefully this video was helpful to you. I will post a ton of CS2 content and will continue to inform you guys on things to invest in, trade-ups you can do, and how to get knives for completely free. I hope to see you guys in the next video. Until next time, peace.